Hi, my name is Brad Neal. I'm with the University of Indianapolis. I'm an associate professor in the chemistry department. And if you found this website, you have found some videos that I've prepared for general chemistry one courses. So the purpose of these videos is to give you an overview and to give you um, some basic information about the topics that are presented. By no means is this the end all be all exhaustive video that will answer answer every single question that you ever have but this alongside a reading of a textbook should give you a very solid foundation from which to start working on homework problems etc this specific set of videos is based off of the OpenStax 2e textbooks that is available um, so I'm sorry the OpenStax uh, website, the Chemistry 2E textbook by Flowers at all. Um, so that would, and it's a free, completely open textbook. It's a fantastic source to read through the material as well as watch the videos. And like I said, the videos uh, loosely correspond to the different sections in the textbook. If you're a University of Indianapolis student and you found this video, you'll have access to additional information via our Brightspace, Brightspace site um, and in-class activities that we'll be doing throughout the semester. If you are a University of Indianapolis student, please be sure to check your email uh, once a day throughout the semester and at least once a day uh, coming up to the start of a given semester. No course material will be actually assigned until the class actually starts, but there will be some communication that might make starting the class a little bit easier, such as here's some expectations, here's things that you want to make sure you bring to class, like a calculator. You always want to have a calculator. You always want to have a notebook or something that you can write handwritten handwritten notes on. Typing in stuff in chemistry is kind of hard on most keyboards. Um, but like I said, if you're a UND student, make sure you check that email and uh, communications will happen via that. Uh, and then once class starts, we'll actually be using Brightspace. If you have any questions at any point in time, please feel free to leave a comment on uh, any of the videos below, and I will try my best to get around to those. If you have any suggestions, I'd love to hear those too. Um, as I guess every person who's ever been on YouTube says, feel free to like, uh, subscribe, and hit the bell for whenever new content hits this page. Thank you very much. I hope you have a great time and uh, enjoy the content. Thanks.